Okay, so today I'm going to be working on my double wide trailer. My, uh, as you can tell, my bunks are in pretty sad shape. This one just kind of fell off. Um, it's completely rotten in there anyways, that's no good. Um, I've got these new 4x4s I've pressure treated. Uh, so now we're going to put some carpet on them and then fix the bunk racks up a little bit because they're a little rotten and bent and twisted. So I went to Pig Iron and bought some of this uh, utility carpet. Um, it's just carpet, you know, no no backing on it or anything. So this one roll should do two, do one bunk. Uh, I just got to cut it in the middle and then wrap these four by fours. And then uh, we should be good. Uh, this was the cheapest cheapest stuff that I uh, could find well that was the only stuff I could find so it'll it'll do I've used this stuff on my other uh, my single trailer to redo the bunks on it um, so should be okay so we're gonna do that right now and <clears throat> cut this in half and then start wrapping these four by fours all right, so I got my carpet cut in half. Um, so I'm just gonna start stapling that down with my hair stapler and then wrap it around and then finish the ends off. And then that'll be one bunk done. So I'm gonna get to that and then I'll show you what it looks like when it's done. All right, so I got one side, uh, one side done there. I've just uh, folded over my excess and stapled it on. So I'm going to do the next side. I'll show you how to do it actually. Okay, so all I've done is start on this side because I have a little bit extra. And went along the corner. So you're starting to get a little bell. I've just, I've just cut this little excess bit off. And then again went to the corner. And cut down it like that. Cut down it like this. My scissors are starting to get a little dull. I'm cutting this fabric. They're just cheap scissors anyways. Flip it over, do the same on this side. And here too. Okay, so next, you're going to want to take one of your sides, fold it in, and trim it up. And then just stick a couple staples in it. And then do the same for this side. Fold it up, staple it in. And one more side. Fold it in. Staple it on. And then this side has a double layer. And I just wrap it right around. Put double layer of 
staples in there and then cut the excess off if I can. Like that, and we're good to go. I'm gonna staple that down a little bit nicer here. that and that's what she looks like I'm just gonna put a couple more in this stuff too maybe trim that up a little bit done so when you go to go park part of it put it on the trailer you're gonna to want to cut little holes in it so you don't uh, when you put the bolts through your leg bolts it doesn't uh, catch and rip your material but other than that 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 bunk's ready. that bunk is ready to go on so I got three more to do My own world of make believe. Kids screaming in the cradles, profanities. I see the world through ice covered in ink and bleach. Cross out the ones who heard my cries and watched me weep. I love everything. Fire spreading all, right, so all I got around four bunks my room. Carpeted. Um, put pressure treating on the wood before I carpeted it. So next I'm going to be working on uh, the brackets that hold these on the trailer. Okay, so as you can tell this is pretty bent up and cobbled and rusted and rotten. It's uh, actually ripping through here. So I'm going to cut these two brackets off and then I'm going to remake this uh, top part. All right, so I got my uh, tray remade. I got my uh, arms cut off. And now I just need to weld them on the bottom like this. Uh, and then hopefully no more of those are too badly fucked up. This one's kind of bent up, but it's just gonna straighten it out and use it anyways. It's not too bad. This up, that other one was rotten and coming apart, so build that and then uh, go from there. Alright, so it's all painted up and ready to go on. I just gotta drill my holes for my, uh, my lag bolts to hold the bunks on. And we should be able to rebuild the rest of it. Alright, so we got the trailer back together for now. Eventually I'm going to replace this tongue, but we'll do that in another video. I uh, got the bunks done. Uh, also in the other video too, I'll be changing out these, these taillights. They still work, but that lens is broken. So they're only like 30 bucks, but I got both bunks in. 
Um, as you can see, the jet skis bolts. Boom. Before they used to practically sit on the fenders, and now they got like two, three inches of room. They're not sitting on the fenders anymore. So that's uh, that's the end of this video for now. Thanks for watching. I appreciate all your subscribers and all the views you guys give me. Thanks. And have a good night. Daisy's got one too many quarters in my pocket. Scandal like the poly clovers in my locket. Untied laces, yeah. Just tripping on day. Dreams got dirty little lullabies playing on repeat. Might as well just ride around the nursery and count sheep.